Mr. Wizard, why do we have to wear safety glasses if we're going to be roasting marshmallows? Well, Brian, we're going to roast them in a very special way. So go ahead, put them on. Okay. And I thought instead of building a fire, we'd roast them with just a fuse. So there are some matches. You light the fuse, then take the matches and go back that way, okay? okay. Must be quite a big explosion if I have to take the matches back with me. Well, just to be on the safe side, okay. Better than building a fire, right? Yeah. A lot simpler? Mm-hmm. Okay. Hey, it didn't do anything. Absolutely nothing. And the reason is because it didn't have enough oxygen. And when you roast marshmallows, you have them on a stick and you bring them out near the, fi near the flame, right? Yeah. And you, and you get it so that it's brown. Well, that's what we're gonna do. And this time, we're gonna add a supply of oxygen. So I'll put the fuse in, you get ready to light it, and then I'm going to put a supply of sort of powdered oxygen. It's, it's really oxygen with another chemical mixed with it, but it, it will serve to give us a good supply of oxygen, and now you will see what I considered a really roasted marshmallow. Oh, yes. Now you'll need the safety glasses. Are you ready? Yes. Remember, you're going to light it, then get back. Hmm. And I'm going to take the supply of oxygen with me. And I'll take the matches. Okay, the match went out. We'll go ahead and put it in there. Okay, try it again. Oh, oh there it goes. Oh. Back away. With a good supply of oxygen, you will see probably the most roasted marshmallow you've ever seen in your entire life. Watch. Whoa, there it goes. Whoa. Still going. Hey, what's all that black syrup around by the marshmallow? Well, that's the carbon. The... Now, that's what I call a roasted marshmallow. In fact, we're even roasting the wood under the pan. Wow. See why you had you wear safety glasses? Yeah. A very dangerous experiment. Fortunately, you can't try it at home because the powder I've got is a secret powder. Well, I certainly wouldn't eat that marshmallow.